hello and welcome to Cricket World on the Road. Yes, in fact, tonight we are at Leicester Square, the Odeon Leicester Square, for the European premiere of Fire in Babylon. This, of course, is the amazing new film brought to you by Revolver Entertainment and it's all about the West Indies cricket team of the 1970s. Tonight we'll be seeing on the red, gold and green carpet the likes of Gordon Greenwich, Michael Holding. We'll also be seeing Joel Garner and Colin Croft and maybe a few more stars from film and from the world of cricket. Jim White at the movies. You must be absolutely proud of what's happened already, but also looking forward to this evening. I'm massively uh, proud and massively excited about tonight. And I don't know if that's any of the other guys talked to you. We went to uh, Kingston for the premiere, and uh, it was one of the most humbling experiences of my life. The highlight of my cricketing career was throwing the ball back uh, to the fielders at Lords in a county cricket game. You know the ball used to come over the boundary and little boys would leap over the fence to throw it back. Uh, when I saw the crowd here, I really couldn't believe it. I, I mean, I've seen these things. Or, you know, I've been in the crowd myself sometimes. So now I'm not in the crowd, I'm a part of the celebrity? Oh God, I'm confused with that word. You know, we, we, we quite enjoyed playing playing together as a team and playing uh, representing the region. I think that that is more important to us than anything else. Cricket. Yes. Long heritage in your family? Well, what happens is, uh, once every generation, there comes a team that can kick England's ass. Obviously, being Irish, that's us these days. But before us, there was the West Indies. Next. <laughs> <laughs> this is a first for me, let me tell you. On a red carpet, well, actually, green, yellow and red. But um, well, We're just saying every, every home should have one. Uh, well, I, no, I've got one of these in my... Uh, <laughs> In my house, not. <laughs> but uh, no, it should be a good night. So when I was about eight, I did that. But my release mechanism in my hand went wrong. And I threw the ball, instead of throwing it to uh, John Snow, who's going to pick it up, I threw it back over my head and into the upper tier of the uh, nursery end stand at Lord's, which was deserted that day. <laughs> but these guys were the best. And, and when they came together as one, the combination of Michael holding Andy Roberts, Joel Garner and Malcolm Marshall is perfect for balance. And that's the best ever. Just another one last question for you. Is this carpet as long as Michael Holdings run up? <laughs> you can add another 20 yards, I think. <laughs> Enjoy the evening. Thank you. Thanks, Gordon. Thank We're just comparing the, the length of, the, of this red, gold and green carpet. Is it as long as your run up? Longer. Much longer. Gordon said another 20 yards. No, no, it's much longer than my run up. And today, it's perhaps about five times my run up.